Alright, um, I'm on the Chimera Craft server currently running Direwolf 20. Um, I promised Rookie I'd do a little brief um, introduction to MFR and the possibilities. Now, there's many ways to do MFR farms, and the one I've chosen is um, <coughs> separate planters. So if you look over here, there's a planter down here that um, plants netherwort and plants it in this. Like this is not upgraded, so our little plant is the basic range. Um, I have sugar. This is planted by hand. Whenever it grows up, you'll see there the harvester breaks it. Uh, same goes for the cactus. Um, and manually plant it again. I have a planter over here that plants birch. I can see that it still has a bit of bruise, spruce left from when I switched it. So I'm just gonna pick up the spruce and let that plant. Anyway, when a tree grows up, um, the harvester will come by and take care of it. Uh, this is not instant because well, obviously it's a large farm with multiple things going on. I have wheat here and wheat with its own planter. Again, this plants the seeds. Um, over here, we have spruce. Again, its own planter. And these have individual upgrades. Like this is a lapis upgrade. has a range of one. So instead of being just the basic 3x3, three three, then it's a 5x5. Five five. Um, this here is, again, this is manually planted, even though there is a hole in there, but that's cotton. And it'll pick the cotton when it comes by. Again, this is not instant, because this is a very big farm, so it has a lot of block updates to deal with. But it'll come by eventually and pick up the cotton. Um, same goes over here. I've planted raspberry, blueberry, and blackberry bushes from Natura. Um, it'll actually come by and pick them up, but again, it's not instant, so um, it's not going to look like anything happens, but believe me, um, nothing in here has been harvested um, by hand, and it's been going on for days. It takes care of the pumpkins, too, and the melons, so when they pop out here, it'll come by and it'll harvest them. Now, the harvester has um, a platinum upgrade for a radius of 10, and again, when you're dealing with radius in Minecraft, it's... Um, 10 plus 10 plus 3 for a 10 upgrade, which is 23. So the whole area it takes care of will be 23 by 23. So you can see, uh, 23 this way and 23 across. Um, <clears throat> so basically, the square that I've rounded off. Um, yeah, and as you can see, it, it picked up the <clears throat> um, the cotton is there and it's picked up some of this um <clears throat> anyway yeah that's how it works i'm just gonna sit up here and end the uh short introduction to mfr farms mfr farms can do a lot of different other things um the general rule of thumb is if the planter can plant it it can harvest the um, harvester can harvest it um, so toss in the planter see what happens and uh yeah. Oh, and another little detail that's worth mentioning. Um, you want to make water spots yourself. Like, for example, this is wheat, and the wheat farm is not wide enough to warrant it needing more water, so the central block is fine. Um, but if I was to make a huge wheat farm, I'd have to place down extra water blocks myself. This is necessary, and you need to do it by hand. Alright, well, I hope this is useful.